Yeah, Kem's run to here uh, just beat J-Salt over there on the side stream, or the ah, duo stream. Yep. Uh, Moki, as we all saw, lost to H-Bomb to winner's side. So first loser's match of the tournament. And I am guessing color-wise, Moki is blue. Yeah. Moki should be blue. Uh, Kem should be red or And we'll orange. see. We can ch I'll check controllers. I'll be the tester here. So all right. once the stock's taken, I'll take a little bit of a peek. <laughs> It's always the way. It's when someone when someone dies on the controller still moving yeah. on, you're like, ah, you're the other guy. Not yet. Kem did give a nod on that up smash, so I am guessing that Kem is red. Yeah, we will confirm. That's at least what production told them to do. It's always a question now. Yep, Moki confirmed blue. All right, cool. So we are correct. Yeah, I, and that's the other defensive uh, move that I see a lot now. It's just hold my shield on platform. Yes. And people still hit it. Like, every single yeah. time people hit well, it, I don't get it. people are saying for years now, like, all right, if you're not comfortable with this, just light shield on plat. But it feels like we've hit a second wave of like, oh, wait, there was a reason we were doing so this good. before. It disappeared for a bit, and now we're back to light shielding on plat. Yeah, and then as soon as, like, they finally grab you, you know the next time, okay, I'll just spot dodge. Okay. Yeah, Moki, <laughs> even things up and then clean things up real quick to yeah. get the stock lead. Kem holding center stage quite well, looking for a lot of the uptills to get an extender here. Ooh, that late nair wasn't actually that helpful. Got a few percent, yeah. but all right, what are you doing in the edge guard situation? Reads the high recovery and just gets it with the bear. Yeah, I like the option. The, That's the confidence. Soft nair or even like reverse nair. I kind of feel like they're some of the new tricks in a lot of Fox tool bits, but that time didn't pay off as much. I like the making sure he's not getting set up from that up smash. You'd rather take the knockdown than just get juggled. Yeah, that was weird. Option coverage. I'm Moki. I'm standing in front of your shield. I'm going to turn around shield because I could cover your defensive options yeah. with my defensive option. Look for a shine at a shield or something yeah. of the sort. Anytime you see just two people sitting in shield at the same time, it's very funny. But I thought it was funny how he ran up, turned oh, yeah. around, and then held no, it was No, it was intentional. It was smart. It just looks funny. It's yeah, like, it looks hilarious. It's like, ah, you're shielding. I'm also scared now. Yeah. I'm going to shield too. It's like, well, no, there's reasons, but... <laughs> Yeah, I would have liked to just see Kem yeah. just throw out the shield grab after all that. Yeah. Nice read. Get some tech chase, up smash. Yeah, a lot, of that, a lot of that started because Kem tried to get this like uh, like run back, turn around, grab on a, a approach and rift, and then that all started from it. Okay. Uh, do we read? Big. Oh, yep. This should be huge. Soft Nair just to tack on a little bit more percent. Yep, no reason to go off stage there, as we talked about in earlier yeah. sets. You have a full stock lead. Play it a little bit safe here. Don't, yeah, don't throw away the life lead. Nice. Oki's oh, been going for that a lot. Yep. I, I mean, mean the, it's just so much safer. There's no more. There, you can't SDI and up smash and survive. The the throw onto the plat, you can see either up throw from below, or the one I think is cute is the back throw, depending on percent. Because uh, a lot of people just aren't ready to tech back throw either. Uh, a few characters can do it too, but back throw up to the, the top, and then you just up smash on the tech. Oh, Moki's dokiing. Yeah. Kem was looking solid for the like most of the last game, but the last couple stocks are very much Moki favored. Yeah, and, and Moki just letting like the up smashes rip. Mm -hmm. What are we gonna see here? Another one right here. Oh, it's a little bit late getting on the plat. We talked about all the different counterplay. Uh, up smash because you can't, like you said, you're not SDIing it somewhere. I'm just putting you into a juggle state. It's one of the moves that's like, yeah, maybe it's not as optimal in certain situations, but it cuts off a lot of the new age defensive play that you're seeing yeah. from other things. I mean, I guess if you have like that, we, we saw Moki do it himself with the crazy DI, where if it's a low percent up smash, he's gonna yeah. be ASDI down instant tech, but you still get an up smash. Yeah, you still get the, the grounded state then. Yeah, you get the grounded state, you get the reset right after, and so you get that fatty percent off the up smash, and you're still in at least a neutral yeah. state afterwards. You're not doing that past a certain percent either. Okay. Oh, just the double nares let him rip. Foxnair is so good. Yeah. Cody, what have you done? This one move is. <laughs> what do we see here? The up smash? I feel like oh! Every, I feel like every year we rediscover like some move that fights like, oh, this this move is really good. And it's like, yeah, it's Fox's entire kit. I don't know what to tell you. Uh, I like the shine stall to reset the jump. Read where Kem's going to go. Yeah, like I said, uh, Kem was looking solid. And then for the rest of this, he's been playing well, but Moki's just been on another level right now. Oh, no, just hard read movement options there. We get one, we get two. Let's say I was looking for a third. Oh, nope. three different turnaround ups instead. 
Oh, it goes for the higher option coverage, much safer. Ooh, that was gross, that was gross! Oh yeah, just get out of there, you don't want to get comboed. <laughs> no clips, no clips, please. Loki, please don't put me on Twitter. <laughs> All right, 2-0 and an emphatic one at that. Going to the final game. I've seen Kem do it before, but it, man, it's you've got a struggle right now. Yeah, this is shaking his head. Just to get the one game to get yourself back in would help so much. Just the, the mental reset that it affords you. Yeah, but, it just takes it right back. I mean, we were saying before that Moki's very momentum-based, mm -hmm. and it, seeing Ooh. a good Moki is like you. It's not just you got to reset. It's also you have to make him bleed. Oh, yeah. yeah. You almost, like, and maybe that's where Ken was thinking. Maybe I do take him to, like, Dreamland or something and try to play slower. But in terms of play style, they're pretty similar yeah. aggressive, high APM foxes. Yeah, I don't think you got to change your play style. It's just to, like, switch up the momentum, switch up the velocity just a little bit at spots. Clean it up. There you go. Yeah, Ken taking go. the time to think before this game is really paying off here. Dominant two-stock two -stock right. lead. <gasps> very oh my, we're just watching Task gameplay right now. They both did the same exact dash attack into the drill into one another. Yeah, that was the right thing to do there. Yeah, <laughs> yeah a little bit of a okay. get off me. I know this won't kill you, but I, I, I just need I, to recover. I said we need a momentum shift. Going up four stocks to one is exactly what you're looking for. You're a Kem or a Kem fan. Yeah, and that was kind of the mistake there for Moki. I think Moki in game one or game two had the opportunity to hit that up smash to get the kill on platform and just kind of whiffed. Okay. All right, one on the board, but that took so long for Moki to find anything. Kem is looking yeah, phenomenal, Kem is right? I feel like we were watching a different player. Oh, yeah. Or at least a different two, like maybe they just swap these change. <laughs> maybe they change colors in between games that we don't know. They, they just switch controllers. For oh, fun. oh, wait, that is such a crazy idea for Moki there. I'm not going to do the falling up air. I'm just going to do a nair. Yeah. Oh, no, the backwards laser grab ledge. Kem hey. is looking good. That is exactly what Kem needed. That, that was the, the, the shift there was the palpable. You could even hear the room. Yeah. Like, the room went from like, oh, cool combos to like, oh, like the little bit of hush was like, oh, like that's the, oh, kind of like, oh, he's he's not dead. He's still in this. Yeah, pull shield on platform, just get out of there, try to get a slide off or something of the sort. You don't want to get grabbed, you don't want to get extended on. Oh. Yeah. The big thing that we had said though is it's because Kem was able to take immediate stocks. If he's not able to grab a lead early, this could be rough. Yeah, you were talking about extending with like uh, going for the back air, like yeah. mixing it up, or back throw, mixing up things on platform. Yeah. I liked the fair extension there yes. because Moki was trying to get a mistech on side plat to then punish and get the stock. Ooh. Yeah, Moki's tech chasing with Shine right now. Like, yep. I, I think he's going to be looking pretty good. I don't <laughs> think that game three is really like it dusted much for him. I don't think it shook Moki, but it depends on if Kem is now feeling more into it. That being said, uh, I don't know if Moki's giving Kem time to feel yeah. more into it. This Almost the like the exact same look as yes. game three just swapped, like in terms of momentum. Like now Moki looks really hot. Unfortunate yeah. SD there, just hits this straight happens, horizontal yeah. input. Oh, and now we have the transformations that you didn't, you talked about how you don't want to change the pace of play or change the play style. This These transformations might do it for you. Okay. Doesn't go, and say there, decides just to take some damage, doesn't go for the infinite. Yeah. I also don't know if the infinite works if you're up on the flat or not. But. Yeah, you might have some like SEI option. The get up attack is actually so nasty there. Ooh, that up, up tilt. tilt. That, 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 is, that is so good. Up tilt, oh, they can, oh my god, that conversion was sick. Yeah, right, reverse cool. up tilt, link into the fair. Mm -hmm. <laughs> just bear into bear into bear. Yep. <laughs> it's just like watching Moki do the 100 win challenge all over again. Okay. Oh, just standing there. I don't know what Kim was looking for. Maybe just like some sort of crouch cancel, ACI down option. The falling there again instead of the up air. Going up there for a grab. Oh, raw grab. Oh, no. Yeah, that's it. I mean, that's, that's it. That's Whoa. it. Why didn't Moki look? <laughs> it's just lifted his hands all I don't know. <laughs> they both looked a little confused after that. I think something, yeah. Maybe there's an audio. I don't know. No idea. 
Yeah, Cam took his hand off the controller too, right before, because I think he may have just on the missed like, oh, shoot. Yeah.